This is the best way to level your weapons in Modern 3. So if you want to max out your weapon level fast, you're going to want to watch this as I have leveled up my weapon 10 times in one game. Without wasting any more time, let's get into how you can do this as well. To start things off, make your way over to the zombies area, which is over here on the main menu. From here, you want to click the gear icon at the top, and you want to use whatever weapon you can use that you want to level up that you have unlocked. So you can either use one of the contraband stash items that you have that they give you, or you can use an intro weapon, and you can ensure any weapon that you want. And this is very important and crucial as well, is go to the tactical area. You'll find several monkeys in the game. If you have one, keep them. If not, you want to use decoys. First, the scatter mine, depending on your level. If you have decoys unlocked, use decoys. If you're not, use the scatter mine area. And the lethal does not matter. You can use the breach drill or throwing knife, is what I recommend. And then the frost blast for the field upgrade is really good. If you can, use the Tesla Storm though, if you have that unlocked, once you do get it unlocked. Otherwise, if you don't have either one, you probably want to use the Frenzy Guard one, and then you can also use Energy Mine if you want. It kind of is up to you for these two, but I would highly recommend using Frost Blast if you don't if you have that unlocked and then tesla storm if you have all of them unlocked from there you're gonna go back over here you can do squad fill if you want to i probably recommend it just in case you go down a lot and it also helps you out in the game once you scout the operation up you actually can do a mission and i recommend doing a mission on the side while doing this you get more xp as along with it start the game up and while you're loading why not go ahead and drop a like while you're at it once you load it up into the zombies game you're gonna want to open up the map from here you want to find a contract the deliver cargo is a good one it's really easy I would recommend staying away from the ether extractions. They are a little difficult. The AIs do hurt a bunch if you're doing it solo. Even if you're doing it with a group of people, you gotta be really careful with it. But doing it solo is almost impossible unless you're really good and just take it really slow. Which you can do. But I'm gonna try and do this one, which is the deliver cargo. So just find that one, mark it, and get to it as soon as you can. We are at the contract. We're gonna pick it up and accept the mission that's gonna give us. And then we're gonna find that area where we have to go to grab it. Also, by the way, you can kill the zombies. They do give great XP. And even if you open up stuff, you get XP as well for it, for even looting, which is nice. You get XP for literally doing anything in the game. Once we get the mission, we got to make our way over here now to this building and grab that cargo. We're going to make our way to the vehicle and we're just going to start driving it. So I'm going to enter the thing and it's going to tell us where we need to go. So yes, there's the attack helicopter right there chasing us. So just be careful. You don't want to just stay around in one spot for too long and have it uh, destroy the vehicle because it can destroy the vehicle and blow it up and you just fail the contract. Now, another great tip is before we get to the contract area, you can pop a double XP in the game so you don't waste any time with this because obviously you don't want to waste, it counts down every single time, even loading into matches. So if we wait till the end before we complete this contract and pop a double XP, we'll be able to get the maximum amount of XP with the double XP um, boost available. So I'm pulling up, I'm gonna go over here, additional XP boost, and we'll just pop a 30 minute one right there real fast. It takes two seconds. And then we'll drive over here, run over the zombies to get XP for that. And just run over this and you do get the XP for it. And look at that, level up right there just by doing that. It's the next step to get even more XP to stack on top of all the contracts that you have done during that match is to make your way to the extra site which you can locate on the map, which are these icons. And once you are there, you want to call the helicopter in to come pick you up. There will be a huge wave of zombies that you can use your field upgrade on. So make sure you have saved up your field upgrade. And if you want to see all the mastery cameras and see how they look like in-game, I've done a showcase fully weapons of what multiplayer and zombies mastery cameras look like. So check it out here. 